According to a parish official, 1,722 people were able to get a COVID test at its three public testing sites here in Jefferson Parish today. Johnny Bright Playground is one of those sites, but unfortunately, about 100 people were turned away this afternoon after waiting hours for one of those tests. This Jefferson Parish car marks where a COVID testing line in Metairie was cut off two hours earlier. But the last car is six blocks from where the last person was swabbed. More than 100 people waited hours to get tested here at Johnny Bright Playground, only to be turned away. We were here when the confusion of it all was just setting in. They said if you're not already up in the queue in the parking lot, you're not going to get tested today. Oh, that's not okay. good. How long have you been waiting? About two hours. I've been in line since about 3 thir um, 12.30. So over three hours? Yes. <laughs> and they're shutting it down? They are. <laughs> a private company, AccuReference, is responsible for the testing at this site, which is part of an expanded testing effort by Jefferson Parish. In order to close on time Tuesday, they said they'll come in early Wednesday for those who waited. We're going to have a, a line specifically for you guys, and we're going to test you first thing in the morning. Come in an hour early just to test you. People in the line tell me they were exposed to COVID over the holidays and are worried about spreading the virus. Some, like Maya Armstrong, need a negative test to return to work. I don't know if I can do it. I'd rather just quarantine until further notice. And it's not just these public testing sites that are overwhelmed. The hospitals are feeling the strain, too. I'm told today at just one emergency room on the West Bank, 60 people showed up trying to get a coronavirus test. They were directed back to these public sites. But the concern tonight is if these public testing sites can't work faster, people will skip the testing process altogether and the virus will continue to spread. Reporting live, I'm Jennifer Crockett. Back to you.